my dear friends namaste my name is siddhartha krishna today i want to talk about raga and dvesha when i was in bali i used to go with my father to the black sand beaches for our morning prayers we would sit there as the sun rose as i read to him from the gita the sky changed from vermilion red to bright blue slowly other friends also joined us and we had beautiful discussions as the waves rolled in and a soft breeze was flowing around us this was an idyllic moment it is in human nature to become attached to such moments and want to have them again and again this is raga attachment how does ego asmita which i talked about in my last talk evolve into attachment once you have a constructed central i anything that feels pleasant to it you become attached to that for example if my constructed understanding of myself is that i am a scholar of yoga philosophy it is very natural for me to become attached to yogic concepts and notions that attachment to what i see as my concepts even can give rise to dislike towards opposing ideas this leads to intellectual conflict since attachments like these produce conflicts suffering naturally follows this is why affliction is a type of this is why raga attachment is a type of klesha affliction in addition to attachment raga etymologically also means coloring it is the coloring that a pleasant experience leaves behind for example when i traveled to beautiful places like bali or the sunshine coast in australia i had very beautiful experiences like what i just mentioned this resulted in very positive associations with those places these associations have colored my thoughts so i have the desire to visit them again if i had had bad experiences there or if i visited another place and had a bad experience then my associations would be negative and i wouldn't want to visit again this is dvesha aversion hatred dislike remember the constructed central i anything that feels unpleasant to it you dislike that like attachment aversion too is a form of coloring as you can see both color of our experiences they are the two sides of the same coin whether good or bad coloring it prevents us from seeing things as they truly are this is why the goal in yoga is vairagya which even though mostly translated as non attachment in fact literally means freedom from coloring thank you very much namaste